story here at 11. This man credited with saving three lives, including his own, after a near-death experience near Malfunction Junction. A lot of heavy traffic going through the area at the time. Fox 13's Marissa Lynn met up with that man who had to make some quick decisions. And Marissa, he was actually able to lift a vehicle off of a state trooper. Yeah, Chris, the man had never experienced adrenaline like he felt when he saw this trooper pinned to the ground. It all started when the driver of the car he was in suffered a medical episode. Kenny Franklin's trip to work Thursday took an unexpected turn. He requested an Uber driver, and he was off and running. Then he says his driver suffered a seizure while at the wheel on I-4 near I-275. His foot is accelerating on the gas, and instantly I'm in the back seat wondering, okay, my life is pretty much over at this point. Franklin was able to safely get the car to the side of the road. He says that's when the driver awoke in a panic. You know, he didn't know where he was at, so he tried to put the car into a gear. And so he's fumbling with the car. Franklin jumped out of the car, and behind them was a Florida Highway Patrol trooper, Jack Hypes. He starts walking up towards me, you know, to assist to assist and assess the situation. And um, as he does that, the driver mistakenly puts the car in reverse and hits the, and hits the, the officer. This side of the car mm -hmm. hits him and his impact was to come over here pretty much fall over the rail. Hypes was pinned under the vehicle. Adrenaline is racing, your heart, you know, is, is going a million miles an hour and all you're thinking about at that time is this, you know, this needs to end well. With so much adrenaline, Franklin was able to lift the vehicle off of Hypes. He suffered non-life-threatening injuries. All three men involved will be okay. FHP commended Franklin, and some would even consider him a hero tonight. Honestly, I just was somebody who was in a position to help in the right place at the right time, and I'm, I'm glad that, you know, I had something to do with, a, you know, with life, lives being preserved. Would you do it again? Absolutely. In a heartbeat. In a heartbeat. Well, Kenny told me that he plans to meet up with Trooper Hypes after he recovers from his injuries. Trooper Hypes credits him for saving his life. And Kenny says he was just doing his job because every life is important. Chris? Quite a, quite a story there. And I'm guessing if Kenny were to ever get pulled over in the future by a state trooper, he might... He might, he might be able to be let go. Might yeah. have a little wiggle room there. All right. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, Marissa. Hey, Shalom, I'm like you. Yeah, Kuala La. Yahweh Baha Shem, Yahweh Shai, Baha Shem, Rakwak with us. The blindness to the other apostles of great Muslim and Ruwa. And peace and salutations to the Yaakim out there in the highways and byways. Doing this work sincerely, diligently, and faithfully all around the world. Now, what you just saw there was a Jake, you know, that lift the car, you know, off, you know, that lift the car, you know, when it when that state trooper was under that car pretty much pinned you know so what you had was a jake he ended up using his strength into lifting the car off of that officer you know and this just proves that you know we are the true biblical israelites that the bible speaks of you know that the scriptures says that you know let me actually get it real quick So this is the book of um, Genesis 25 verse 23 and it reads and the Lord said unto her two nations are in thy womb and two manner of people shall be separated from thy bowels and the one people shall be stronger than the other people and the elder shall serve the younger so what you just saw you know was a Jake ended up lifting up off a um lifting up a car off of, off of an edomite that was pinned down you know you know well you know so what you had was was the jake he ended up lifting that car you know and that and that just goes through because the main players you know the main players on the earth today are jacob and esau 
you know those are the main players that are on the earth you know those are the top nations that are on the earth you know but then consider you know Esau being in power you know and everything because you know if you read later on in the scripture in the, um in the scripture in this um chapter it reads that you know Esau would receive a blessing which she got the left hand side of the blessing which she's living out his blessing now you know he's in power now so he's living his best life now meanwhile we're in we're in captivity under uh, under him but the point is that you know that one people shall be stronger than the other you just see that jake you know lifting up a um Probably like a two-ton vehicle, you know, from off from um from off a police officer. So you know, so you know, and this is just a regular Jake, you know. This just proves that we are the salt of the earth, that we we are the stronger people. We're we're stronger mentally, physically, we're stronger physically, mentally, and all of the above, you know. This just shows you. And going back to um, Elder Apostle Taha's um, video, recent um, video that he made two weeks ago about a man called Mark Felix, you know, that was able to hold, you know, these two um, in when they had that hold, you know, that, um, you know, y'all brothers, if y'all get a chance, y'all could um, look it up. Mark Felix, you know, you know, that video got 20 million views. Well, it might be up more now, but, you know. When I saw it, it was like 20 million views right there. You know, this, this just shows you the strength and the power of our people, even in our low state. You know, this just shows you how strong and how mighty our people are. Because we were, we were those great people, great warriors, back when King David and King Solomon was ruling. We are those people, you know. So this just shows how, um, what we could do, you know. And how strong we are as a people you know this just proves that you know that we are the true pe biblical hebrew israelites you know and we are strong and we are the sh we are a strong people so with that you know i want to give all praises to you how about shimmy out shy by shimmer crocodash double honest to the apostles of great most on that rule well and peace of salutation to the yakim out there on the highways and byways noise in this road abroad it's one of the bring this quick video out and show the strength and the, sh um, the strength of our people, you know. So with that, I want to say shalom.